everybody. This, in this video, I'm going to show you how to um, taper a man's pants. Um, so I'm going to work on a pair of slacks. So the first thing we're going to do is um, take out the hem. So, and I'm just going to show you on one leg and, uh, and then you can just repeat the process on the other leg on your pants. Okay, I took my hem out. Now, you may not want to press your hem out since you're going to hem it back up. I am not going to do that here. Um, this is just to show you how to take up the sides. Um, say you want it seven inches and it's eight inches. You take that one inch, divide it by two, you're gonna do a half inch here and a half inch here. And then um, you go from there. Now, when you're taping, when you're tapering your pants, um, you want to do it equal amounts on the inseam and the outseam because if you don't, the center crease is going to be off center, and that's not going to look good. So, determine how much you need to take off on each side, and use your chalk to mark it. I'm only going to do this um, on a quarter inch. I'm going to do quarter inch here and a quarter inch here. Um, because I really don't need to take these up. I bought these for this purpose for this video. So I'm just going to do quarter inch. Whatever your stitching line looks like, you need to stay with it. So if it goes in a quarter inch, you're going to, you're going to keep your line, um, a quarter inch from that. You just, you're going to follow the same line. I hope that's clear. Um, I'll explain that in another video on how to hem pants if it's for a large person because this area here is going to be much narrower narrower than the pants would be even right here. So we'll go over that another time. So basically what I'm saying, if you're doing a quarter inch, it's a quarter inch, a quarter inch, a quarter inch, a quarter inch, or quarter inch, until you get to where you're gonna taper off. Now, if your pants fit okay up here, but it's just a little large here, then you might want to taper just to the knee. Start at the knee and taper in. If it's the whole leg you want to take up, you can take it up from the crotch. I'm going to do from the knee. And if you look carefully, now some pants have the lining that goes to the knee and you would just go, you know, taper from a little bit into the lining down. This has no lining, but if you look in the seam allowance, you'll see a little notch here and across from it, you'll see one here. That roughly um, marks the, uh, there it is right there, marks the knee. So what you can do is find that notch and just mark it, find this notch and mark it. Now, like I said, from the, from the hem up to where you're tapering, it's gotta be the same distance from the thread all the way up until you start tapering. So this is a Okay, um, I chalk lined it and I went to the machine and I sewed right directly on my chalk line. Now, if your chalk is not sharp, and sometimes it could be like an eighth of an inch wide, you wanna sew to the edge that is closest to the inside of the pant, just where the chalk and the pant line meet, um, because that is actually where your ruler was and that's where your line was supposed to be. Now, right here, when you get it to the knee, you need to be careful, not careful, you need to be sure that your new stitching line crosses over the original stitching line because when you take this thread out and those stitches don't cross over, you're gonna rip your, your thread out and it's gonna take all the seam out with it. So, and that's not fun. So make sure that they interlock, they intersect because it's going to uh, lock those stitches into place. So that's it. I'm going to take out the, the original stitching line. Then I'm going to, I'm going to take out the original seams. 
I am going to press it open and I'll be right back. All right, everybody, that is it. Um, I took it to the ironing board and I pressed my seams open after I took the original chain stitch out and this is what it looks like. And then you're ready to hem it back up. I have another video I wanna do when the crotch of your pants are too low and um, how to take up the waist in the, in the seat of pants. If you would like to see those next, please leave a comment below. If you would like to see um, something else that I haven't thought, haven't done yet, um, leave a comment in the box below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much. Bye.